Hello everyone, let's learn about AR today. Augmented Reality AR is a technology that overlays digital information on the real world in real time. This means that you can see digital objects superimposed on the physical world around you. For example, you can use AR to see a dinosaur skeleton superimposed on your living room floor or to see how a new piece of furniture would look in your home before you buy it. How does an AR work? Number 1 Number 2 The device's software then uses computer vision to identify objects and features in the real world. Number three, the software then overlays digital information such as text, images, or 3D models on the real world images. Number four, the overlaid information is synchronized with the user's movements, so it appears to be part of the real world. Let me show you a clip of person checking furniture and deciding where to place them. Now, here are some examples of different AR experiences that people can create. Number 1. Games AR games are a popular way to use AR technology. Some popular AR games include Pokemon Go, Harry Potter Wizards Unite and Jurassic World Alive. These games allow players to interact with virtual objects in the real world. Educational apps AR can also be used to create educational apps. These apps can help students learn about different subjects in a more engaging way. Some popular AR educational games include Anatomy AR, The Elements AR and The I AR. Virtual Try On AR can also be used for virtual try-on experiences. This allows users to try on clothes, makeup or other products without having to physically go to a store. Some popular virtual try-on apps include Modiface and Perfect Cop. There are many other ways to enjoy AR experiences. Here are the steps involved in creating your own AR experience. Number 1. Choose your AR platform. There are a number of different AR platforms available, each with its own strengths and weaknesses. Some popular AR platforms include AR Core, AR Kit and Vuforia. Develop your content. This is where you will create the virtual objects that will be overlaid on the real world. You can use 3D modeling software, 3D scanning or even just photos and videos to create your content. Design your experience. This is where you will decide how the user will interact with your content. Will they be able to move it around, rotate it, scale it? You will also need to decide where the content will be placed in the real world. Build your app. Once you have your content and design, you'll need to build an app that can display it. This can be done using a variety of programming languages and frameworks. Always test your app. It is important to test your app thoroughly before you release it to the public. This way it will help you identify any bugs or any problems. Deploy your app. 
Once you're happy with your app, you can deploy it to the App Store or Play Store. Here are some key points to remember about AR. AR is a technology that overlays digital information on the real world. This can be done using a variety of devices such as smartphones, tablets and headsets. AR can be used for a variety of purposes including games, education, marketing and training. It is a powerful tool that can be used to create immersive and interactive experiences. When creating AR experiences, it is important to consider the following factors. The environment. AR experiences should be designed to work in a variety of environments. The user. AR experiences should be designed to be easy to use and understand. The content. AR experiences should be engaging and interesting. AR is a rapidly evolving field. There are always new developments and trends in the AR technology. It is important to stay up to date on the latest developments in order to create the best possible AR experiences. Here are some additional tips for creating successful AR experiences. Make sure the experience is relevant to the user's needs. The user should be able to see how the AR experience can benefit them. Keep the experience simple and easy to use. The user should be able to figure out how to use the experience without having to read a lot of instructions. Use high quality content. The content should be clear, sharp and realistic. Test the experience on a variety of devices. Make sure the experience works well on different devices and in different environments. Get feedback from users. Ask users for their feedback on the experience and use it to improve the experience. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.